the chosen replacement for lawn sculptures jockeying for decorative attention. Budding tulips, yet to crown, yet to blossom after the toil of shooting forth from the soil, from the planned seed planted. Stalk naked beneath the rising ultra violent sun, a floral sensuousness will eventually be on full display, welcoming the selfie paparazzi for a close-up. In the public eye, if only from afar, the object of desire is forced out front tempting viewfinders to create interpretive representations, portraying the youthful and delightful carefree glow. All the while, feigning imperviousness to the human element. The perils of being trodden or mowed down, never entertaining exhaustive engine emissions. Solitude beside a tree is not destined unless the bulb was placed the previous year. Here, the stem is less likely to be shivved by a rotary blade, thus protected, body guarded. The haphazard who peruse the property have the opportunity to critique the impressionistic seen for artistic correctness. Is the gardener's intent colonial, heading in the right direction? Or has the Edenic arrangement been left undone to controlled chaos? The question is set aside to ponder that which has been vaulted from the yard, unable to withstand the rigor. The once displayed botanical endurance now bestowed the security of a pot, not the vanity of a vase. The transference is accommodating. The displacement is reminiscent. Time to convalesce, to mull over the preciousness of an imagined life actualized, of wisdom withering, petals and leaves decomposing, resting in peace. Decayed dirt, fertile residuals, attentively cultivated by a scrutinous, compassionate eye.